In today's video, we bring to you the top 10 most stunning tourist attractions and lively places in Aruba, making it the most visited island in the Southern Caribbean. So without any further ado, let's jump right into the video. Number 1. Aracoque National Park If you're a nature lover, then you'll want to check out Aracoque National Park, which covers approximately 20% of Aruba. With its windswept coastlines, cactodotted landscapes, and limestone cliffs, Aracoque National Park is a great place to discover Aruba's wild beauty. Some of the creatures you might run into at this hilly park include the Aruban whiptail lizard, Aruban cat-eye snake, the Aruban parakeet, and the Aruban burrowing owl. The park is also home to three beautiful beaches, Dos Playa, Boca Prins, and Daimari Beach. One of the park's most popular features is the natural pool, which is also known as Conchi. Number 2. Day Palm Island Aruba If you are searching for a getaway while in Aruba that offers a little bit of everything, then you'll want to sign up for an all-inclusive private island adventure at Day Palm Island. You can also choose between a full or half-day adventure, and your entry fee covers many activities including zipline rides, salsa lessons, and banana boat rides. It also includes breakfast and lunch buffets and your drinks. Day Palm Island also boasts its water park, and because this is a coral island, the surrounding waters are teeming with clouds of colorful tropical fish, so snorkeling is yet another option. Day Palm Island Aruba also offers an underwater helmet walk that allows swimmers to enjoy a scuba diver-like experience. Amazing, right? Number 3. Alto Vista Chapel At number 3, we have the Alto Vista Chapel. Even if you're not a Catholic, you want to check out Alta Vista Chapel, which is located on a hill near the town of Nord. Yellow in color with a red roof, this tiny church contrasts nicely with the bright blue sea behind it. Although this current structure was built in 1952, there has been a chapel on this site since 1750. If you decided to visit the Alta Vista Chapel, make sure to check out the Peace Labyrinth where you can meditate or pray while walking through its circuits. Number 4. California Lighthouse Next up is the Stone Lighthouse, which was built between 1914 and 1916 and is one of Aruba's most well-known landmarks. Although modern technology has now made it obsolete, the 100-foot-tall California Lighthouse is still a big draw for tourists, especially since it offers some of the best views of Aruba's jagged coastline. And if the trek to the top of this structure should leave you hungry, there's an on-site restaurant located in the former lighthouse keeper's house, where you can grab a bite to eat. Number 5. Baby Beach Baby Beach is one of Aruba's best-known beaches. It is a beautiful, shallow, man-made lagoon with very calm waters, making it perfect for children. Baby Beach is also popular with kiteboarders and windsurfers. You can find this beach on the southeast end of the island, away from the bustling resort area. Make sure to enjoy your time with lots of fun-filled activities. Number 6. Antilla Wreck Coming up next is the Antilla Wreck. The SS Antilla, which is the second largest shipwreck dive in the Caribbean, met its demise in quite a dramatic fashion. In 1940, less than one year after the ship made its maiden voyage, its German crew set it ablaze rather than have it captured. Today, the wreck, which is teeming with tropical fish, is a popular site for both snorkelers and scuba divers. It is considered by many to be one of the best shipwreck dives in the Caribbean. Number 7. Orange is Dead At number 7, we have Orange is Dead, which is the biggest city in Aruba and also its capital. It is also a popular cruise ship port, so don't be surprised if the streets are occasionally crowded with cruise ship passengers checking out the town's shops and restaurants. Strolling through Orange is Dead, you'll find a mixture of colorful colonial buildings and high-rise resorts, restaurants, bars, and shops. Getting around Orange is Dead is not a problem even if you don't have a car, as there is a free tram service that makes a half dozen stops throughout the city. Orange is Dead also boasts the longest linear park in the Caribbean. This park's main feature is a paved trail that is perfect for walking, running, and biking. Number 8. Bubali Bird Sanctuary At first glance, Bubali Bird Sanctuary doesn't appear to have much to see, but those with patience and a good set of binoculars will be rewarded with the chance to spot more than 80 species of migratory birds. Head to the observation tower for the best views and keep an eye out for such birds as Caribbean coots, pied-billed grebs, and various herons and egrets. The sanctuary is a wetland preserve within walking distance from Palm Beach. 
it's best to go in the late afternoon or at dusk when the birds are more active. Number 9. Bushirabana Gold Mill When explorers first stumbled on the New World, most were in search of riches, especially gold. And in 1824, those dreams of riches finally came true in Aruba when gold was discovered by a 12-year-old shepherd boy while he was herding sheep. Eventually, more than three pounds of gold were extracted from Aruba. At first, the mining on Aruba was done by individuals, but eventually, all of the mining rights on the island were given to a Dutch company. Today, the old stone ruins of the gold mill at Burashibana are a popular attraction for tourists. They can be visited on foot, or if you'd prefer, you can also see them as part of a horse riding or ATV tour. Number 10. Palm Beach Last but not least is Palm Beach, where you can find the majority of Aruba's high-rise resorts. This area also boasts many restaurants, casinos, bars, and shops. So if you won't be renting a car, Palm Beach would be the best place to visit in Aruba as it is very walkable. In addition, Palm Beach surf is typically calm, making it ideal for swimming. And for those times when you're bored with catching rays or wading in the surf, you could always rent a paddleboard or a wave runner from one of the many water sports concessions in the area. Palm Beach also offers some of the best nightlife in Aruba. If you want to know more amazing travel tips and discover stunning destinations in the Caribbean, make sure to check out our next video.